Temple. Cool board. Thanks. I just wanted to let you know I'm a big fan. I've been following you since, well, forever. <laughs> That's sweet. Uh, I I'm a little busy right now. Actually, I was about to fire my assistant. Just messing with you, dude. Oh, hey, good luck on your audition. Oh, your routine. It's nice. Nice? Nice? The struggle, mad skills on the move. This is what we do. We find our way through the struggle. Mad skills on the move. This is what we do. Wow. You can really sing. Thanks. Uh, please pretend you didn't hear that. I mean, like, really sing. Like, Taylor Swift meets Ariana Grande meets. Cutting to the chase, you should totally join our act. You're exactly what we need. Yeah. No. Was that a yeah? No. <sighs> Seriously, Devin, with your vocals, we'll crush the competition. How awesome would it be to perform for Elite? Look, Bree. Bri. Really? I'm gonna have to pass on the offer. I'm a me person, not a we person. Yeah, feel free to share that with your friend Pam. It's Cam. <sighs> All clear? That's my job, kid. All clear, sir. Room. I'm gonna take another car and bring the luggage, okay? Oh, good thinking, Gillian, but hurry up. All right, sir, hurry. You got it. to the Quayla HQ. I just sounded so professional. HQ? HQ? <laughs> no, I'm gonna ask Addison to find us the nearest Innovate Safe House. I live right near here. It's perfectly safe and it's a house. <laughs> You're telling the truth, right? This isn't just about you wanting to have a prince in your house? It's very close, Swearsies. <laughs> it's close and it's the perfect place to take a selfie with the prince. <laughs> <laughs> Not exactly the local hotspot I was expecting. Well, sorry there's no velvet footstools or funny court jesters to entertain you. Well, I was half wrong. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some life and death matters to tend to. Meaning your life. Right, I got that. Hi, this is my house, Bride and Vandeweth. We met at the training facility a while back. You remember, right? Or maybe not, I don't know. And now I'm just wasting a little time you have left here. If only I could control all the loot myself. Nice to meet you. I'm Adrian Adams. Growing up in Spain, I traveled to London all the time. I love everything British, except the food. Terribly bland. Rubbish. Exactly. It does taste like garbage. Who cares about food when we could be discussing the spacecraft's thrust to weight ratio? Happen to know what that is? All I know is they're going to blast me into the sky. <gasps> where I'll finish my most epic Snapchat story, and then they'll bring me back down to Earth. Bringing you back down to Earth would be a good thing. Good afternoon, agents. Hoping for a progress report. Well, I did restock the fridge with your cold-pressed green juice. 
nicely done. But I was referring to the three T's. Our latest suspect is Elite's lighting engineer, Cameron Breyer on it. And we were just discussing this harmless piece of a banana leaf. Same one I noticed on your nightstand, Agent McAllister. Maddie dropped it when we saw her in the hotel. Which I forgot to mention. Sorry. But we did see those banana leaves down at the Maywood Glen docks. Which means your sister might have been down at the docks. The same docks where the three T's are arriving. Your colleagues are raising a very interesting possibility. Which I refuse to believe. There's no way Maddie could be involved with the 3T robberies. Is that Agent McAllister talking or a worried sister? I adore them both, but this is definitely worried sister. <laughs> Salud. Well, here's what I think. Maybe Maddie was trying to leave us a clue. Maybe she really is in danger. We're going down to the docks, so whatever the truth is, we're gonna get some answers. Right. Good idea. <laughs> you know what you need to do. And I know you guys are giving me that Michaela's got it all wrong look. <laughs> Don't be you silly. You got it all wrong. Meaning you've got it all wrong that we think you've got it all wrong. I'm gonna stop talking. I've repurposed my original Cam's cat cam with Cam's catch a criminal cam. You don't know what I had to do to get it off the cat. Now we just have to get it on that grade. Follow my lead. My gosh, I'm so sorry. I told my friend Cam a million times not to ride that thing inside because you never know when someone's gonna take a left when you thought that they were gonna take a right, and then they take that left and you take a right and boom. Uh, don't worry, I'm I'm fine. Okay, bye. <laughs> Camera planted. Now wherever he goes, we go. We wire the oxygen compressors. Right, as opposed to pumping oxygen in from the exterior, they need to suck it out. The compressors must be behind this wall. Uh, guys, can we hurry this along? Hey, Cameron. I have to tell you something. Uh-oh. If, if all this doesn't work, and, you know, we don't make it. Zach, why don't we talk about this later? Sure. Okay. Seal the door. Pouring hot water onto dry ice, frozen CO2 changes it from a solid to its gaseous state. I know. It's called sublimation. Zach knows chemistry. Ready? Now! Once the oxygen is removed, we'll only have an hour left to survive in our suit. It's working! It is! <laughs> we did it! Yeah. 
All right, we did. Ah, it. Give it here. <laughs> go us! Go us! Go us! Go us! Congratulations, Al. We never doubted you. Mm -hmm. Whew. That was close, huh? Too close. So, I just wanted to say that these last few days, when I was giving you a hard time, I guess what I was really trying to say was, I like you. It was just my way of showing it. Zach, I'm shocked that after all your name calling and your nasty jokes, you think saying you like me would make it all okay. Grow up, Zach. If you ever want a girl to like you, you might try showing her some respect. <laughs> <laughs>